Hello, I'm Steve. This is Bit of Bunch. And it's blooming hot in this kitchen, I tell you. And I've got the oven on. Am I mad? Quite possibly. Anyway, <laughs> the hardships I go through just to review pizza and eat pizza. <laughs> right, home bargains. New pizza, another one. Yes, I tried one a few weeks ago. Which was a bit... Meh. Actually, no, it was better than meh. It was more meh. Right, if you haven't seen that one, then have a look at it after this. Anyway, uh, wood-fired stone-baked pizza. Spicy salami and enduya. It's a frozen pizza, this one, and this was £2.19. Good price for a wood-fired pizza. Italian wood-fired pizza topped with Italian tomato sauce. Creamy mozzarella, mozzarella cheese, spicy Italian salami, and fiery Italian enduja. Yeah, we'll see about that. Uh, made in Italy, 24 hour rested dough, salami and enduja made in Italy with EU pork. Uh, 350 grams, and your percentages are Mozzarella cheese, 14%. Now on that other Home Bargains pizza I tried, it had a good amount of mozzarella and it had good cheese pull. So I'm hoping this one will, will as well. You never know, it might be made from the uh, made by the same people. Uh, tomato puree, 13%. Spicy salami, 8%. Tomato pulp, 4.5%. And do your 4%. And loads of other stuff, obviously. Brum, brum, brum. Anything else of interest on here? I don't think so. The description is probably the same as there. It's the same as on the front. Made in Italy. I've told you that, haven't I? I think I have. It's already in the oven. Normally, when I review a pizza, I will show you, show you the pizza before it goes in the oven. I completely forgot this time. I blame the heat. Well, I blame the heat. And, yeah, and the cider. Right, I've also put in the oven a few of the sides, jalapeno nuggets, which I reviewed very recently, which are excellent. They'll go really well with a pizza. I know they will. Right, I think that's about all I can tell you. It looked like it had a good amount of enduja on there, so it could be pretty spicy. I mean, I'm... I say, I'm so hot now, I'll probably, hopefully, hopefully I'll be even hotter when I've tried this. Is that a strange thing to say? Well, yeah, might be, I don't know. Right, I'll bring you back when it's all done. And there you go. It looks really good. I'm even hotter now. It's a really hot day, and this is now a really hot kitchen. Anyway, beside that, yeah. <sighs> the smell of the salami on this is really quite strong. So, I'm going to try a bit of that on its own first. It's a little bit, um, not tough, but chewier than uh, some salamis I've had. And when I was trying to cut this pizza, trying to cut the slices of salami in half was quite difficult. But that's not really a negative because the taste of the salami is so good. It's really nice salami that. Pretty salty, and also pretty spicy. Yeah, that is a good bit of salami, that really is. Right, put the plate down. Here we go. Mm. 
first impression I get from that is the mozzarella. I reckon this comes from the same um, manufacturer as made that other home bargains pizza. Because the mozzarella on it, the taste of it, is really good. It's really creamy. And it's, it's excellent. It's, it really is excellent. And wow, there's some spice there. There really is. Right, a bit of the crust on its own. Mmm. A very airy, crispy crust that's really good. I've actually got a McDonald's garlic mayo to have <laughs> to have with it, dip the crust into. But that is a good crust. This is a good pizza. It really is. Mmm. Now, I wouldn't describe the Induya as fiery, but it's definitely, definitely got some spice. That and the spicy salami. There's some heat there. Pretty spicy, good amount of mozzarella, good tasting mozzarella, really good salami, nice bit of uh, heat to it. That is a really good pizza. I really recommend that, definitely. £2.19. Iceland pizzas, their wood-fired range, I think are about £2.50 at the moment. I mean, they're really good. The Iceland wood-fired pizzas are really good. This is cheaper, and it's it's just as good in my opinion. They had a few different varieties. They had a um, margarita, and one second, if I can get it out of the freezer, so it's a bit buried. Bear with me. Bear with me. It's coming. I've got this one. Got <laughs> the ice on it for my son and his girlfriend. Um, roasted vegetables pizza from the same range. So obviously they haven't had that yet, so I can't give you any feedback on it. But if the overall quality is as good as this one, then it should be really good. If they try it soon, which I'm hoping they will, I'll put a little uh, a comment, an update comment down, down below somewhere. At the top, because I'll pin the comment. Right. Yeah, definitely recommend that. Really good. I'm going to go and really enjoy that. Yeah. There you go. Another close-up of it again. Extreme close-up. In case you've forgotten what it is. I recommend it. Right. Thanks for watching. Please hit the like button. And I will see you in the next video.